Hello Disney fans, my name is Haley and welcome back to the Disney Cupcake Channel. Today we're going into Target the week of Christmas to see what's going on. Is there Valentine's Day stuff now? Who knows? Let's go see what they got. It looks like they still have some Disney like Christmassy things. Some of the ugly sweaters are all moved around. All the stuff seems to be condensed like to the front of the store here as far as like outfits go. It's very very strange. They still have some of the pajama sets. I don't see any of the Mickey pants anymore. This is so weird because all of these clothes were in all the different areas. Like, you know, kids, men, women, all that. I also forgot to mention, make sure to subscribe down below so you do not miss my Christmas haul and all of the Christmassy things that are still left to do this year. The child, you know, we're just gonna go back to the toys and stuff now. All right, collectibles, what do we got going here? Um, actually a lot of empty shelf. Our little Mandalorian section is absolutely wiped out. They do have the IG-11 fig pin for $14.99 and some of the child pop sockets. They're also Still, the Target exclusive Galaxy's Edge Pops. I'm kind of waiting for those to go on sale, honestly, before picking them up. They're $8.99. Everything else is kind of wiped here. The Pops themselves, they still have the Haunted Mansion tea. Actually, a lot of those back there for $17.99. Still some Frozen 2. I'm really hoping there's going to be more Pop releases next year because target's been kind of low on things they have soul joe and the tuck and roll aliens and that's it even the jumbo ones are gone that have been there for a bit so hopefully we'll see some new ones here soon let's go over to the toys they have the new 2020 uno it's like super like minimalistic looking looks super cool that's 10.99 i know that's not disney but i thought that was kind of neat car section looking very plain nothing new kind of some more empty space on this one it is just five days before christmas whenever i'm filming this so a lot of the stuff's kind of picked over already here's a quick look at the trading post section galaxy's edge nothing one babu frick left but i wanted to point out the legos i just took a quick pan through like the doorbells and all those things and there's really nothing but the lego aisle Look at this. The Lego aisle has nothing in it. There's like one version of each set left. This is like the second aisle. I need to show you what the actual Lego aisle over there looks like. On the end cap right next to the Lego aisle, they have some frozen two little mystery balls. Eight surprises inside. One tattoo, four ponytails, one ring, one bag, and one surprise it says, and that's $4.99. They have ones for a couple other shows too, but no other Disney ones except for this Marvel Snaps one. Also $4.99. That one's a little bit of a bigger prize. And there is the Lego aisle. There's a bunch of people down it right now, so I'm not going to go down the aisle, but that's what it looks like. It looks exactly like this, just on both sides. Absolutely insane. Definitely the toy of the year. Our Pixar section looking pretty wiped out too. Lots of our favorite Toy Story characters gone. I'm interested to see if they'll get soul stuff. I know I said that last time. Waiting to see. I know the Disney store had some stuff. Our Star Wars section. I cannot wait till they have the Mandalorian helmet out. I know Best Buy is going to be getting it in June. I hope Target gets it too. I'm seriously thinking about buying it. <laughs> so I'm just excited to see like new stuff that come in. I know a lot of this stuff's picked over because of the Mandalorian just ending. Because of, I mean, people's Christmas gifts. So, Star Wars section update. Kind of sad. I can't wait to see when they like put all the new stuff out. Maybe there'll be some other new items for the different series coming out soon too. Check this out. Target now has a fig pin section, $14.99 for these. I'm just gonna kind of pan through them. It looks like our Disney ones are here on the bottom. They have Wally and Eve, which I did do a video on. They have Mickey Mouse. They have both versions of Baymax, and they also have the Clone Wars ones. Those are so 
awesome. Oh, very cool. Very, very cool. Uh, so back here with all the Christmas stuff, they moved a bunch of like overstock toys back here. Um, so there's just like a super big toy section now. Not really like Disney things, unfortunately, except for this like Frozen 2 chair back here for $34.99, it's like a little mini couch. But wow, they cleared out this Christmas stuff. Oh no, I can't wait to, like over the next few days, all that's gonna be gone, it's gonna be so sad. I wonder like what else will be out. I know Valentine's Day, but like in this area, are they gonna start putting like the summer furniture out again? I have no idea. Look at all the other cute little blankets. Those weren't here last time. Let's check on the Disney ornaments and see. Eh, there's actually still a good bit of those left. All the little blind bag ones are gone. They still have some of like the plasticky $7 ones, but they're so cool. They're like nice big fillers. Oh, this Groot one, I don't think we saw. That's a nice tall ornament. That one's also $7 and then that's, that's like it. All the ornaments just gone. Very, very sad. And even all the little candies too. All of the little candies, little stocking stuffer items are all just kind of wiped out. The only Disney stocking stuff items I saw this entire time were these little makeup kits. They're buy one get one 50% off right now. And the Marvel Lip Smackers. Those are the only Disney stocking stuffer things I saw except for the, like also the Mandalorian little candies and stuff. But those have been sold out for a while. So I'm kind of disappointed with the stocking selection for this year. Check out this candy aisle. This is where all the like M&Ms and Hershey Kisses are. What? Look, even over there, all the stockings. This is an empty Target. Even the chips. The chips. What happened to all of the chips? They still got my popcorn though. That's a good thing. <laughs> and wait for it, the bread. Where is all of the bread? What is happening? This is all of the whipped cream and the milk. I think people are just trying to stock up so they're just home for the rest of the week, like for Christmas and stuff. So like that makes sense. But the people who aren't doing that was kind of like, kind of confusing. Even the ice cream. Whoa. They still have the Mickey ice cream though. These ice cream sandwiches are so good. I, I might need to get more of the Star Wars ones and rewatch The Mandalorian. I would like to like rewatch all of the Star Wars movies. I always do that around Christmas time, so maybe I'll need to pick up some more of those while they still have them. So that's going to do it from Target. Very interesting how everything was just like gone. Um, I'm hoping to go back soon-ish once they get more things. I think they're gonna get more stuff here in like January, like once the holidays are done, like they'll start being new releases for the new year and stuff. So we'll be back in a little while, give them some time to get some new stuff out. And I cannot wait to see what else they get. I hope you all enjoyed this kind of short Target video and I hope you have a wonderful holiday. Remember to do what you love and do what makes you happy. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.